under your folder connections you can see the c drive is connected and under the c drive there is a geo database called default the house icon here shows that it is the current default geo database now i will use a simple tool to show you why you need to change the current geo database i will add the input features and the output file will be generated automatically the file will be saved in c drive in default geo database which is this geo database if you do not change the current default geo database all your output files will be saved in the same geo database now to change your geo default geo database select the particular geo database here i have created a geo database under this folder right click on it and click make default geo database now you can see a house icon on this and this doesn't have a house icon which indicate that this is the current default geo database now if we go back to our tool and provide the input features the output file will be saved in a different drive and in a different geo database called project which is this project geo database which we have created it is always better to have separate geo databases for each project to make it easier to manage 